well, B's here, so let's check in with the weather. How's it looking? Better. It's not raining, amazingly. <laughs> Thanks, <laughs> Gemma. Amazingly, we've got some dry weather for the next few days, albeit quite cloudy at the moment across the southwest. But we had some beautiful pictures come in this morning of our sunrise, and we've got largely dry conditions as we head through the next few days and into the weekend. This large area of high pressure is fairly static over us in the next few days, keeping the weather quite quiet. More of a northwesterly wind tomorrow, slightly dry air coming in. So I think tomorrow we'll likely see a bit more sunshine than today. Most places will stay dry right through the next few days and into the weekend but it is quite cloudy out there particularly along the coast we've got a lot of low clouds some breaks i think we're seeing some sunshine from time to time but on balance more cloud around this afternoon light winds and temperatures actually up a little bit on yesterday so particularly if you get some sunshine feeling a touch milder always the risk of a little bit of drizzle over the high ground where that cloud is thickest. Tonight we'll see more cloud coming in. The winds pick up slightly, not as cold as last night. We got down to around three or four degrees across some parts of the southwest last night. Tonight it's more like eight or nine, but it does mean we'll start off fairly cloudy tomorrow. The cloud, I think, will break up a little bit more readily tomorrow. The winds will churn things up. We'll get slightly drier air coming in, so we should see some sunshine, particularly into the afternoon. If anything, temperatures a touch higher. One or two spots could make it to 40 degrees. The Channel Islands have seen some sunshine so far today. More cloud through tonight with the risk of one or two showers. Here as well, it is staying quite mild overnight with temperatures comfortably in the mid-teens. As we head through tomorrow across the islands, starting off quite cloudy. The cloud here I think will be a bit more stubborn, so less sunshine here than across the rest of the southwest. But there will be a few breaks into the afternoon and temperatures similar to today around 13 degrees. More sunshine, I think, as we head through the coming days, but those temperatures really start to drop. So over the course of the weekend, we'll start to get northerly air coming in. Cold and sunny with the risk of overnight frost, but actually looking dry for the next few days. Gemma. Thanks very much, Bea. And that's it from us for now. We'll have more on the autumn statement with Martin at 6.30. Do join us then, but in the meantime, have a very good afternoon. Bye-bye.